Hi, friendships! Just a disclaimer, sorry if the issue being talked about in this today's episode is not current. This video is from July 2019, which is a month late from today's upload due to some technical problems. Updated entertainment issues will be tackled in the next episodes. Now, have some snacks and drinks. Wala nang patumpik-tumpik pa. Mga entertainment news ay simulan na. Entertainment news na walang kinikilingan, walang pinoprotektahan, mga entertainment news lang. Ito ang NN, NNN, Entertainment News Neon, na with me, Nancy G. Are you ready for it? Hi, friendships! Welcome to the first episode of NNN, NNN, Entertainment News Neon, na na! Okay, so wala nang patumpik-tumpik pa, boom, karaka-raka. I just want to introduce myself. My name is Maxi G and I'll be your host for this channel. Malabang channel ko to eh. <laughs> but anyway, anyhow, wala nang patumpik-tumpik pa. Let's go for the first topic kasi ang dami talagang news niyon na talagang umaapaw sa chismes. Sabi. But before anything else again, oh my god, it's so hot here in Chicago. Kaya naman, stay hydrated everybody. Mm. This is so good. Ah. Fruit punch. I love fruit punch. Okay, so. Mm -hmm. And first G ka mga friendship. So for the first episode, ang dami pong mga nagiiin at nagbabagang mga chika ngayon. So wala nang patumpik-tumpik pa. Boom, karakaraka. Simulan na natin ang first issue for this week. Gerald Anderson, isa nga bang dandruff? Sabi! So, nakikita nyo nga, nakikita ko to sa Facebook, ang daming kumakalat ngayon na meme kasi lahat nga ng mga nalink kay Gerald Anderson or mag naging shot ni Gerald Anderson ay may endorsement ng shampoo. So, si Gerald Anderson nga ang sinasabi or tinatawag nilang Dan Draft. Well, in fairness naman kay Mami Divine, good job Mami Divine, hindi natuloy ang pagmamahalan or nag-bloom ang relationship ni Sarah Geronimo at Gerald Anderson dahil nag-intervene nga si Mami Divine. <laughs> Mother knows best nga naman talaga. And before anything else, since we're talking already about Sarah Geronimo, happy birthday, Miss Sarah Geronimo. You're an epitome of beautiful inside and out. Thank you for being an inspiration to us. Na always remain humble and always trust and have faith in God. Okay? I love you, Ate Sarah. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Okay, now, so Gerald Anderson. <gasps> OMG. Pinagpalit nga ba si Bea Alonzo para kay Julia Barreto? Let's watch this. Paalala or disclaimer. Please, wag mang send ng hate or threats sa mga involved or na mention sa issue. Now, simulan na natin ang issue. Kumalat ang balita sa social media na naghiwalay na nga ang magkarelasyong Gerald Anderson at Bea Alonzo na nagkaroon ng short leave relationship noong 2010 at nagkabalikan noong 2016 after filming How to Be Yours. At dahil nandal nito ay ang pagkakamabutihan nila ni Julia Beretto at Gerald Anderson na naging magkapareha sa kakalabas lang na pelikula na pinamagatang Between Maybes na pinalabas noong May 15 in Philippine Cinemas. Nagkamabutihan daw ang dalawa habang ginagawa ang pelikula na sa mga panahong yon ay hiwalay na rin ang magkarelasyong Julia Barreto at Joshua Garcia. At matatandaang noong March 12 ay sinorpresa pa ni Bea Alonzo si Gerald para sa kanyang 30th birthday na mapapanood sa YouTube channel ni Mr. Mike Young na may hashtag na 30 na si Budhoy. So anong ginawa natin? I mean, ginawa mo project for... So, nagkabihan tayo sa surprise party for our team. Uh -huh. 30th birthday. And wala siya talagang banyano because dami, a lot of things going on inside right now. Okay. Third floor. So, At mapapansing sweet pa si Bea na nagbigay ng sweet na mensahe na mapapansin at makikita sa video na ito. Thank you for being such a wonderful man. I love you. Oh! At 
pansin na parang may kakaiba din nang magbigay si Gerald Anderson ng speech dahil hindi man lang ito nag I love you kay Bea o kaya nagpasalamat sa sorpresa nito sa kanya. Salamat sa inyong lahat. Uh, medyo marami ako pinagdara itong huling linggo pero uh, napakaganda dahil nangyari itong Sunday. Kanina lang ako dumating at uh, sobrang nagpapasalamat ako sa inyong lahat. Walang din na yan. Um, bawat isa sa inyo, napaka-improta din sa buhay ko. Uh, kung ano man yung narating ko, hindi ko yung magagawa kung hindi tinaas sa inyo. Teamwork makes the dream work. Nagsimula ang balita na mag-post si Bea Alonzo noong July 21 sa kanyang Instagram ng blackout photo na may cryptic message na you can't make the same mistake twice. The second time you make it, it's not a mistake anymore. It's a choice. With the capital letters, ENOUGH. Pagkatapos ay sinunan pa ito ng post sa kanyang Instagram story na nagsasabing Something I learned about people, if they do it once, they'll do it again. Ito ay matapos mag-post ang isang Instagram user ng photo ng Between Maybes co-stars na sina Gerald at Julia na nakitang magkasama sa birthday party ng best friend ni Gerald na si Raver Cruz. At sabi din ng Instagram user na umalis ang dalawa na magkasama sa parehong kotse at ang mapapansing iba daw ang body language ng dalawa. Moments after, nilike ni Bea ang post na ito. Bea Alonzo na interview na. Boom, welta. Ano nga ba ang sabi ni Miss Bea Alonso? Ano uri natin to? No na. Si Gabi lang ni Gerald na matagal na kayong hiwalay. Um, actually, sabi niya because to my under Ah, uh, he said that. Okay then. Because honestly, to my understanding, we did not break up. He just started not talking to me. Okay na yun, Bea. Feeling ko, pinalaki ako ng ABS-CBN na professional and I always have to show up regardless of whatever's happening in my life. Are you okay? Um, I'm moving forward. Hmm. But, syempre, hindi naman ako pwedeng magpakipakita. Tsaka sinasabi ko to habang nandito, parang nakakahiya. <laughs> But I'm really sorry. Kapag <laughs> <laughs> dito, wala kami. <laughs> uh, malaking bagay na nandyan yung mga kaibigan ko. Malaking bagay na... Um, maraming nagkikare para sa akin, maraming, actually nagbubulat nga ako, maraming nagpapadala ng bulaklak, ng maraming nagte-text, and malaking bagay yon sa akin, sa ngayon. Ayan! Titang-tita! Gerald, ha? Sinasabi ko talaga, sinasabi ko talaga sa Gerald, mali talaga yung mga ginagawa mo ba? Huwag kang nanakit talaga ng babae ba? Perfect guwapo ka, eh? Ano, may karapatan na? Kwako, loko. Ayan tayo, pagwapo. Okay lang manakit. Magpangit, kagaya namin. Aroy. Ayun, nakulong. Ano ka kayo? Miss Bea Alonzo. Sa interview na yan, malalaman mo talagang she's still hurting, but just always trust God. God's perfect time and the right or the perfect person will gonna come for you. Okay? Darating din yan. Yung... In God's perfect time, the right person will come. Just trust in God, Bea. Because, I mean, you know, that's the reality of life. Talagang lahat tayo nasasaktan. And, um... And actually, it's a blessing na meron nga si Bea ngayong project. So, at least, you know, it can help her redirect her emotion, her um, hurtful feelings towards what happened. So, and Gerald... Please make up your mind and kung, you know, just always communicate to the person. Kung ayaw mo nang ipagpatuloy ang relasyon, then tell, tell the other person. Hindi yung pinapaasa mo sila thinking. Because the way Bea said it, parang si Gerald, according to Bea, sila pa ni Gerald. And for Gerald, hindi na sila. That's the reason why communication is very, very important. So, sana ma-fix nila to and, I mean, may nabasa lang ako sa comments na once manluloko will always be manluloko and that's sad. That's very sad because baka dumating yung time na kayo din yung lokohin. So, moving on, let's go to the next chica. Nanay ni Julia Barreto na si Miss Marjorie Barreto. 
OMG! Magde-demanda? <gasps> Alamin natin? No, no. So matapos ngang may mag-post ng picture ni Julia Barreto at ni Gerald Anderson na magkasamang umalis sa party ni Raver Cruz, agad-agad nag-post din at dumipensa ang nanay ni Julia Barreto na si Miss Marjorie Barreto at ito ang sabi niya. Please explain too that this was taken at the party of Raver that you zoom in this photo. If you care to zoom out, you will see that there were a big group that includes my nephew. I don't see anything wrong with this photo. They don't see to be hiding. They are people around and if I'm not mistaken, Julia was waving at someone. This is not a date. They know each other. They have worked together. They are friends. At according nga sa Philstar article na sulat ni Miss Nets Mirales, ang latest pa daw mukhang magdedemanda si Miss Marjorie at ididemanda ang naglabas ng photo ni na Julia at Gerald dahil sa nagsuggest na magtake siya ng legal actions para matuto ang nagpakalat ng photo. Ang sugat ni Miss Marjorie ay yes! I will. Hindi na pala mabasa sa Instagram account ng kanyang fan na naglabas ng photo ni na Gerald at Julia dahil dinilit niya ang post nito at naka-Friday setting na rin. Manabanggit din ni Miss Marjorie na maglalabas siya ng statement kaya maghintay lang tayo. Pero ano kaya ang magiging reaction ni Marjorie na kay Bea ang suporta ni Gretchen Pareto? OMG! OMG! Ang init nga ng usapan ngayon tungkol sa issue na yan. So... You know, in the next episodes, manalaman natin kung ano talaga ang totoo pag narinig na natin ang both sides of the issue. But let's move on to the next issue. So to the next issue, let's be happy naman! Oh my gosh! So Miss Angel of Sin, the General's daughter, ikakasal na! OMG! Congratulations Miss Angel! Best, best, uh, bisaya, uh, lumabas talaga pagka bisaya ka. <laughs> Best wishes to you and Mr. Neil. So, all the details and more, let's watch this. <laughs> Na surprise ang lahat sa good news ng actress si Angel. Engaged na sa kanyang boyfriend na si Neil Arce. Eight years bilang magkaibigan ang dalawa na nagsimulang magdate noong 2017 at officially in a relationship noong 2018. Lahat na excited sa engagement photo sa Instagram. Nagset ito ng Philippine record for 1 million likes. One cent for all, let's hear it from the general's daughter, Angel Loxin. Ready na nga ba siya sa mga bago at mga paparating na ganap sa buhay niya? And the bride to be is in the house, Angel Loxin. General's daughter Hello. and soon somebody's wife. Oh, that's no one. So, handa ka na ba? Ah, siguro naman po. <laughs> ready, oh, ready oh, na po. Oh, yes. Um, very excited. Ay, tataka ako, bakit ba parang nasisilaw ako? Doon pala nang gagaling yung glare. Ah, wala naman po binatbat ko sa <laughs> sexy niyo po ba? Yeah, kailangan ko mag-shade sa. Yeah. Um, yeah, si Neil. Si Neil po yung <laughs> nakaisip ng lahat ng ito. Oo oh, oh, nga. So, ready ka na. Ready, ready. I'm so happy for you, Miss Angel and Neil. OMG! You deserve that one because you're a true angel. Talaga. Like, you have a beautiful face and a beautiful heart. So, congratulations. You deserve that. But then again, even though the happy moments, may issue pa rin. Luis Manzano may sinasabi tungkol sa pagkadawit ng pangalan niya sa engagement ni Neil at ni Miss Angel Loxin. Ha! Huh. Let's all watch this. Hindi ko lang kung dapat ko talungin sa iyo. Baka magalit ka pala niya. Hindi kasi di ba engaged siya si Angel right now. Wala nang kinalaman sa kwento niya. Pero happy ka for... Huwag niya ako idamay sa kwento niya. Hindi kailangan ng opinion ko dyan or ang pangalan ko dyan. Basta ako natin masaya ka right now. So wala akong kinalaman sa kwento niya. How is... Okay, first and foremost, I love Miss Angel Luxine. She's also the epitome of beautiful inside and out. She's really a true angel. She, she has a pretty face and a pretty heart. And Luis Manzano is very funny. Like, natatawa ko lalo na sa mga Instagram post niya. But then, Luis, hindi lang talaga tama yung the way you answer the question. Okay? Why can't you just say, I'm happy for her, you know? I mean, kasi naging ex mo din naman si Angel. So, bakit parang it, it really sounds bitter and that's that's not nice kasi may pinagsamahan kayo naging 
Joa Mullen Shah. So, you know. But then again, you can just say, I'm happy for her. And also, sa mga nababash kay Jesse sa Instagram or social media, guys, just stop it. Okay? Kasi, ang nangyayari, they, they're thinking na yun yung mga fans ni Miss Angel Luxin. And no, it's not. Actually, yung mga fans ni Angels are also angels. You know? I mean, let's just stop negativity and spread positivity. Can we just do that? Kasi ang ikli lang ng buhay. Okay? And then, to Miss Angel Luxine and Neil, congratulations! I'm so happy for you. Wow! I'm just like, at the Angel, you deserve Neil and you guys deserve each other. Be happy and best wishes. I love you at the Angel. You're one of the best um, showbiz icon in the show, uh, Philippine industry that I know of. Okay. And guys, before I said goodbye, just don't forget to watch July 31. And hello, love, goodbye by Katniel and Alden, Katniel, sorry, by Catherine Bernardo and Alden Richard. So sabay-sabay po ta kayong manood this July 31 and manunood po kami dito sa ibang bansa because by its trailer, I think maganda yung movie. May review po ako dyan and I'm gonna put the link down below. So mga friendships, magkita-kita ulit tayo sa next episode ng mga entertainment news na walang kinikilingan, walang pinoprotektahan, mga entertainment news lamang. Ito ang NNN, NN Entertainment News ngayon. Na na! With me, Maxi G. Have a nice day, friendship, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!